Ball to the outside, get it out of bounds, save your timeout, move the ball downfield to get your team in a position to win the game. And a field goal, of course, no good. They need a score. He's back to throw. And it's a short one here, complete to the tight end. And he takes this one just shy of midfield all the way to the 49. A good pick up there of 20 yards. Back to throw. He's going to let it fly. And he can't hang on to it. That would have sealed it. To step on the gas again. They just did it on the last play. Looks like they want to finish this one off. Over the middle complete. It's Williams. And able to break one tackle, but then quickly brought down. That throw good for only a couple. It brings up third down. They're making steady progress, but I see your face. You're worried about that clock. I'm worried about the clock, and at some point, you have to have a splash play in there as well. He'll look to throw. And it's a short one here, complete to his tight end. And they'll be inside the 25 now at the 24. The reception good for seven. It's third down. Back to throw. And completes it to Kirk over the middle. The Cardinals forced to burn their third and final timeout as they'll stop it with 17 seconds to go in the game. They'll look to throw. It's caught. Nelson. And he'll have the first down, getting this one to the 14-yard line. Down to seven seconds now. Six. And they'll stop it with four seconds showing on the clock. One last shot now for Bradford. And the pressure will get to him. He goes down. Now there is a flag on the play, but this looks like holding, holding on the offense. offense. So they will take the sack instead of the penalty. And it takes another down off the series. But they the biggest the final play to get in, and they couldn't do it. It certainly is. So Thus looking... far, the crowd getting into it as we come up on a big third down. Ready. He'll drop to throw. Catch here, left side, Thomas. And they pick up 25 as they convert on third. From the red zone now, they'll look to throw. That's going to be caught at the 10-yard line. And he's going to be brought down just They're going to look to throw. His pass caught at the four. And he'll be brought down right on the edge of the goal line at about the one-yard line. A five-yard gain, and now they're set up first and goal. He'll look to throw. And his throw is going to be incomplete. They'll look to throw. Throwing over the middle, and it's incomplete. They've been stopped twice at the one. Can they finally break through on third and goal? to throw and he takes this into the end zone for a Chiefs touchdown Jason Morrow his first touchdown of the new season and the Chiefs are an extra point away from tying up this football game so that didn't happen you can't yell at your D for that they've got to take care of their own business and reestablish themselves now that they're back on the field a screen to Bell now he goes spin he finds an opening. Now Bell hit. He lost the football. First down now, but that clock rolling. Throwing now is Roethlisberger. Breaks a tackle. And he was hit as he threw it there, and it forces it in. Can you catch the ball? They've got to elevate their game and come down with these in order to keep your offense moving. And McDonald here over the middle. And he's brought down. The passing game in rhythm right now for Pittsburgh. There's another first down. First down now, but the clock continues to move. Roethlisberger to throw. Got a man open. It's Darius Hayward Bay. The Chiefs now going to use the first of their timeouts. Look, there's a...
On the counter, here's Bell. And he'll be a little shy of the 25 here at the 26-yard line. Right back to him on first down. And he's going to take this one down to about the 23-yard line. A give to Bell. And a stoppage here. Hey, hey, hey. You got three days. Blue, there's a... The give is to Bell. And they'll get him down right about the 20. Give him a couple on the run as it brings up a fourth down. And that carry probably not so much for yardage just to get the spot that you want to kick the field goal. And then the yardage game, they're really kind of gravy. And this just becomes what all coach used to say. Get into position to be in position. <laughs> and that's what they want. The right spot for their kicker. Ball marks, right? <laughs> Seeing the 14. That didn't happen. So it's still first and goal, but now they get to try from a bit closer. They'll try and pound it in with Burkhead. They're able to get a couple here, but won't get across the plane as they stop it right around the one alone to the right. On second down, here's Brady. Trying to drop one in, but it's incomplete. The windows are so tight. You just don't want to force it in there because it's going to be tipped up and picked off. Brady now on third and goal. And almost intercepted. Would have been a huge pick in the end zone. I'm with you on that one. Let's just go ahead and be frank about the whole thing. The only one happy about the three-point kicker. Exactly. <laughs> he put it through the post. That's going to help him at contract time. But that offense, they're thinking, let's get in the end zone this time. I don't know if that helped him at contract time. You, you could have kicked that one through. I don't know about that. <laughs> toe bash. I don't know about toe that. Toe bash. <laughs> Super toe. And he'll be On second down, here's Yeldon. And just a short gain that time as they're able to get him down. And now we'll see a timeout used on defense. They keep it on the ground. This time it's Fournette. And he gets this one just shy of the 40. They'll mark him down at the 39. Whistles now. They keep it with Fournette on first down. And he'll be taken down just shy of midfield. Portal's going to look to throw, and his pass incomplete. Niles Paul, the intended target. They tried to throw on second down, unsuccessful. Now it's third and one. They'll try and run for it with Fournette. And he's got the first down before being taken down at the 46. And five yards on the play there as the drive will continue. And Charles, I think when the schedule comes out, all teams, no matter where they're predicted to finish, talk about protecting your home turf. They'll fall to one and one. And they'll look to get back on track. Off season and continues to condition during the season in order to continue to carry the ball at this rate. Throwing on first is Garoppolo. That's going to be caught at the 10-yard line. Now Garoppolo on the bootleg. And it's complete in the end zone. Touchdown, 49ers. George Kittle from eight yards out. And the forced fumble defensively leads to six points for the Niners. Last drive starting backed up in their own territory. Why would you change anything? They've got to be confident about what they're presenting and continue to do so. Because yeah, the secondary, they really look clueless. And that was amazing because that drive went and went. No adjustments and no big plays by the defense to knock the ball away. Now, correct me if I'm wrong. Yeah, you're down two scores. I don't think you need to rush just yet, but you can't take your time either. Yeah, even if you don't want to commit to full two-minute offense, you have to, up to put on your mantle when they give you the game ball if your team wins. So much confidence flowing through them right now, throwing the football. I think it's permeated itself throughout the entire team. Didn't happen on that play. Now Mahomes throwing on second down. On the crossing route, complete. It's Thomas. And he gets it inside the 35 and just shy of the third. Yard passing game. To me, 300 yards still signifies excellence, and he's achieved that in this performance. Over the middle, he's got Watkins. And inside the 20 before he's brought down. Back to throw, Mahomes. The tight end, Kelsey, has it over the middle. 
And able to break one tackle, but then quickly brought down. But a nice little gain. A good pick up there. Eight yards on the first down completion. Mahomes to throw. And this is caught now for a late touchdown. So hold everything here. This one's not over yet. Okay, game on. Don't go anywhere yet. You got a one-score game now. Because you're either thinking, my replacement may get an opportunity. <laughs> Your head better be on a swivel. Totally. Or maybe I just need to get out of the game for a while because I just can't slow these guys down. They've got to figure out a way to disrupt these offenses. Here's McKinnon. And a good swarm to the football defensively as they get him down at about the 40. Here again is McKinnon. And this play will be blown up. He'll lose yardage back at the 38. Something special in them that will allow them to function in these types of situations. Now it's time for them to be clinical and not emotional. You know your play sequence. You know what has to get done. Get the ball to the right people. Get out of bounds and get it downfield and try and score. And he's trying to earn his stripes here for a winning drive. The way he's throwing the football today, almost a surprise when he doesn't complete a pass like that there, but he needs a few more to get his guys downfield. Well, the way he's throwing it leads him to believe that he's going to get those completions. And that means the guys going out for passes, they'll run even harder because they expect it as well. Back to throw. And his throw is going to be incomplete. Sammy Watkins, the intended target. That'll bring up second down. This defense hasn't had the best showing in this game, but a critical knockdown there. If they can hang on, I guess the end will kind of justify the mean. Certainly. And oh, a crusher there as it's intercepted. Ruben Foster picks it, and they will take over at the 29-yard line. Down to a knee for the 49ers. This one about to be on ice. 